My name is Shane, and I'm a second year student in MFA Design. I'm an explorer who dares to challenge, so I like to try areas that I haven't touched before. Virtual reality is one of the directions I'm interested in. First of all, I'm interested in children's project. So in opportunity, I learned that children with congenital heart disease need to face medical procedures from an early age. I think this kind of experience is terrible for the children. And I saw a video in my initial research. The children's psychological pressure before the operation is tremendous. Therefore, what I want to do is to help children with CHD reduce anxiety. The whole experience will start from visit day, and the children will meet with child life specialists and get the storybook, which explains anesthesia tools and the procedures in the form of a story. On the day of the operation, the children will start a VR experience before the process, and the content of the experience is similar to the story in the storybook. This story will revolve around the theme of adventure, challenge, and help. There are magical creatures and talking animals in this fantasy forest. The green jungle is used as an environment to relieve children's visual and auditory tension. The primary purpose is to relieve the tension of the children visually and acoustically to this forest. The children need to help the animals and rescue them from the spell. It is noteworthy that the VR experience will synchronize with the medical process in the hospital. For example, when children ride a unicorn to the castle in the story, the medical staff will take the children to the operating room. In this process, children will not be affected by the surroundings because they are still immersed in the VR experience. After arriving at the castle, the children will find their final destination and the equipment will be very close to the operating room. It can help them familiarize themselves with the environment and not feel unfamiliar and fearful of the surrounding when they take off the VR headsets. In the picture, we can see the Drago animals in the medical costumes to let them not be afraid of the medical stuff. After the VR is over, the children will take off the headsets and the nurses will help them wear an anesthesia mask for the anesthesia procedure. This is all my uh, projects and I'm still excited about this project and I can't wait to see how kids use it before the surgery.